So who are you and uh, what do you do? Yeah, my name is Barry Abrahamson and I uh, work on WordPress.com. I run systems and uh, infrastructure and servers and stuff. So what exactly is your MySQL used for WordPress.com? Yeah, so WordPress, the open source blogging platform, is actually 100% uh, built on top of MySQL. We use uh, only MySQL on all of our uh, on our yeah. database servers. We have about 300 database servers currently, um, about 70 million tables, and uh, doing tens of thousands of queries per second. Uh, out of curiosity, why 70 million tables again? 70 million tables because uh, it allows us to easily shard across all of our 7 million blogs. Um, it allows us to do schema changes online and uh, it's the best performance for what we're doing, what we've found so far. So what kind of data sets are you looking at here? Uh, we have um, we have a few terabytes of data in MySQL, I'd say somewhere between six and seven. Um, some of that is user data, blog content, some of it's stats, some of it's logs, et cetera, et cetera. And how is your MySQL used so far, and how many machines are you at, and how many instances are you at? Uh, yeah, we have about uh, 350 instances spread across about three hundred physical servers uh, in three data centers and uh, it's been great so far. We're running version 4.1 through 5.1. Why the mix though? Uh, different instances are running different versions so um, in, a, in, a given, in a given set of data the master and slaves will all be on the same version but uh, we have some data sets that are still running 4.1 from legacy stuff. All the new stuff is running 5.1. So you guys have very interesting stuff that happens with stats. Can you tell us more about that? Yeah, sure. So uh, we collect stats uh, on all WordPress.com blogs and we display them to users in their dashboard. Um, it requires about 150 gigabytes of data into MySQL every month. Um, and uh, the data is queried many hundreds of times per second. And so we're using sharding to allow us to scale that across multiple data sets, across multiple servers, across multiple data centers. So currently it's an hourly based stat thing. Uh, currently, it's a daily. Currently it's daily. Yeah. Um, hopefully within the next uh, week or two, we're going to start exposing hourly stats. Okay, so people are going to get more finer grain stats on your blogs Ex now. Exactly, and the big feature of that is, is not only finer grain stats, but it'll allow you to switch when your day ends. Currently, we assume, and we have to, that all days end and start at midnight GMT. Um, obviously not everybody's in midnight GMT, neither of us are. That is so, true. So uh, allowing collecting hourly stats allows us allows the user to be able to choose exactly when their day and start and end starts. Okay, and uh, with regards to WordPress.com, you guys have a lot of blogs. They're all active. What's your uh, what are you facing most? Is it heavy reads, heavy writes? How are you scaling? Luckily for us, the majority of our trend, uh, the majority of our operations are read operations. Um, in most of our data sets, we're 90% plus read, um, which allows us to scale out easily using single master and multiple slaves. Okay, so um, currently in the process of switching uh, a lot of our data sets to solid state drives, uh, which provide us uh, about 24 times the capacity of our current uh, SaaS based solution. Wow, so solid state's really giving you a great boost over SaaS. Yeah, luckily for us, with our many tables and using my ISAM. Uh, we kind of fit the uh, workload model perfectly for SSDs. So it looks like uh, Automatic, the company that does WordPress.com, is growing. You guys have quite a number of extra services. Are you also maintaining all of those databases? Yeah, we actually, our operations team is very small. Um, we're, we have about 40 people working at Automatic now. Um, our operations team is basically me. Uh, we have one other guy in uh, New Zealand that helps out. Um, and uh, we have some systems engineers that are working on code level stuff, but not really day to day maintenance or anything like that. Uh, so we're at about a thousand servers currently with an ops team of, call it two, I guess you could say. No DBA, we do all that uh, on the systems team as well. Nice. So you're finding a use of MySQL and replication to be easy and do you see? Do you look forward to using maybe MySQL 5.4, the performance release? Yeah, for sure. Being a website, we're always looking at uh, increased performance. Um, migrating should be interesting, but we're definitely going to take a look at the, uh, at the features and the, and the performance benefits that it provides. Cool. Uh, anything else you want to share with us? No, that's about it. All right. Okay. Thank you very much, Barry. Thanks.